The other big school related story of the day, high school football's postponement. Practice started for teams around the state on Monday. It ended today. Coaches had the emotional task of telling their players. 13 on your side, sports director Jamal Spencer joins us now live with more on how coaches and players heard the news and the reaction, and I'm sure it was heartbreaking for many of them, Jamal. Heartbreaking for almost all of them, Nick. I mean, several high school football teams were actually on the practice field when that news broke earlier this afternoon. Some were in the middle of drills, and so they didn't find out until later. Others, of course, as I mentioned, didn't find out until after practice had ended. Now, Rockford's first-year head coach decided to stay quiet and savor the moment. Our own Mike Lissette has more. Some might have called for the end of practice, but not Rockford head coach Brent Cummings. These kids have been doing such a nice job. We wanted to give them a chance to finish. Which is what they did. For 45 more minutes, the kids could be kids. Unaware, their Fridays had officially become a lot less fun. Let's go! I mean, there wasn't a definite answer, but there was like, I guess, rumors, if you will. But on this Friday, those rumors became reality. 13 on your side was there when Cummings gathered the team at midfield and told them there would be no football this fall. Definitely got really emotional and my heart sank. Definitely a lot to take in. Cummings spoke for several more minutes. As a veteran coach, he's given countless great speeches before, but this had to be his best. It was very important to, to deliver a message to the kids to make sure that their heads are in the right spot, to shift their thinking, to be grateful. And as hard as it may be, not focus on the negative. I just got to keep my head up and just, you know, keep working out, you know, keep watching film and, and just prepare. In other words, coach wants them to keep their heads in the game. To put your thought process there. Even when there are no games at all. It gives you an excitement. Mike Lissette, 13 on your side sports. Now the Rams, of course, were far from the only team that found out in the middle of practice. One area high school football coach who wished to remain nameless said he found out during a water break when one of his players was checking his phone. The coach expressed his disappointment that he wasn't given at least 24 hours notice so he could prepare a proper response to tell his team. I'll have more from area high school football head coaches coming up in sports. Yeah, just disappointing all around for them. Hopefully we get it back in spring. Jamal, thank you very much.